Hi, my name is Anthony Stuckaluck and I'm the Public Education Officer for Thunder Bay Fire Rescue. It's Fire Prevention Week and this year's theme is Working Smoke Alarms Save Lives, Test Yours Every Month. A couple things I'd like to share with you about smoke alarms is it is the law to have a working smoke alarm on every level of your home and outside all sleeping areas. Thunder Bay Fire Rescue also strongly recommends putting a smoke alarm inside all bedrooms. Your smoke alarm should be tested every month. It should be, the battery should be changed every year and a good reminder to change your batteries is when you change the clocks. When you change the clocks, change your batteries. Also smoke alarms have a lifespan. If your smoke alarm is 10 years old or older, it should be replaced with a new one. I would like to show you how to change the battery in your smoke alarm. What you're going to do is every, every smoke alarm has a compartment where the battery is stored. So you're going to open that compartment, take out your old battery, and some of the newer smoke alarms have a device on there that won't allow you to close the door without putting another battery in. So just be aware that it's there. You're going to take your new battery, remove the cap if it has one from the terminals, and you're going to place it inside the smoke alarm, being sure to push down the device that is meant to uh, keep the door open if there's not a battery inside. So as you can see, I've put the battery in, the device is down, and now my door can close. Once you have your old battery out of the smoke alarm, you can take the cap that came on the new battery and place it on the terminals. This is going to prevent this battery from arcing if you were to uh, dispose of it in the recycling bags that the City of Thunder Bay now provides.